Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Zero, and welcome to Handy Worker's Tale, a game about a handy worker who just wants to do their job. Job one: need help. Squeaky cabinet, broken washing machine. Sure, I mean that sounds easy enough. Those are completely two different skill sets, but that's fine. Can we fix it? I don't know. All right, I got a wrench. I I got. You know, I'm not quite sure what I got. I can interpret those multiple ways. Okay. I got something else. I'm hoping it's money, but it looks kind of like lug nuts. So what else did you? What you? What you want me to do around here? Steal your stuff? Okay. Um, I need a hammer. What am I doing with this? Hammer. Time. Every time you see me pick up a hammer, I'm gonna say that. I guarantee you, every playthrough, you'll hear that. Oh god. It's a very slow bar. That I have to time perfectly. Damn. There we go. I repaired your, uh... Your furniture. By hitting a series of right key presses, because that's how repair jobs work. They do not require any... Any thought. They just require you to... Hit the space bar on your keyboard repeatedly. And somehow the hammer does its job. Let me fix your machine here. Oh yeah, we're repairing this good. Just we're just tying up some tying up some things and it's just gonna magically work. No need to switch on any any motors. Any parts. Just tying that thing up. Well, this is an easy job. I'm getting paid for nothing. Can we fix it? More like can we make a a killing on people. This one wants me to fix their TVD cabinet and fridge. Sure. Once again, you know, different things, but hey. Do you want me to repair the fridge first? Sure. What are... What am I collecting these for? No, seriously. Oh, so your house is a terrible layout. What are you doing? Get a better real estate agent. Alright, let's get this working. So we're gonna tie up the, uh... The capacitors and the ignition coil. And that should fire up your fridge... Just fine. Maybe we'll... Maybe we'll clean that pickle filter too. I know exactly what I'm doing. Okay, cabinet. Hammer. Time. Oh, cabinet doesn't need to be repaired in here. Here we go. Why are you people breaking our cabinets? Are you living like animals? Hey, what's happening to this thing? Someone like drop kick it? What was that? No, oh, seriously. I thought I heard weird noise. I just dropped my tools on the ground. That's how you know I'm a professional. It's like I'm a contracting license, just dropping tools everywhere. Gonna fix your TV. Kinda forgot where it was. Okay. Oh, he sorry, sorry. Here, here's your problem. Here's why your TV ain't working. You see these screws? There's a flash right there. These screws aren't in your TV. And you need these screws 
to get the cable. Yeah, that that's about that's about two hundred dollars an hour labor. I want my cabinet, sink, and aircon unit repaired. Well, these are these are needy customers. P.S. Fuse box shorts out occasionally. Okay. Why are we, why are we getting golden nuts? I'd think the the wrench would fix the sink. If we clicked all the nuts, we'd go absolutely nutty. You know, because we've been lugging these around. You all feeling these tool jokes? Sure hope you are. So we, got, we got a lot more. So we got a lot more tools to work with here. Where's your, what's with these places layouts? Oh. Uh, okay. Yeah, no worries. I just go fix a few spaces. Let me just leave this here so I can fix that later. Um, screwdriver probably fixes the fuse box. Yeah, I'll probably. Okay. You just poke it with a metal object repeatedly. That'll really light things up. Can I see something move at the bottom down there? No. There we go. Now we get some light. I feel like the music's changed, am I right? You got some unique electrical contractor in here. Forget about your sink. That's like a weird lo-fi mix. Kinda like it. You're, you, you, you can't hear what I mean, right? Weird. It's kind of a nice noise. Aircon. Uh, screwdriver. Where was your aircon again? Well, it's not here. Can we fix it? Sure we can. We'll have nice cold air and no time. Okay, cabinet. We'll need the hammer. Time. And I saw the cabinet was back here at the end of this long, suspicious hallway. That looks like it was for some dark ritual where all the music has stopped and it sounds kind of scary. And it's kind of picking up pace. <laughs> I'm just a contractor. Leave me alone. I'm just trying to make a living in these hard times. Go bother someone who deserves it. Hey, job fixed. Why this next job sucks? Well, we need the money. Prepare stove. Okay. Where's your stove at? Oh, it needs a wrench. I'm, I'm sorry. I, I brought the wrong tool for the job. Sorry, that, that was a that was a rookie mistake. Feed me. Isn't that what that said in the beginning? We'll just get this prepared nicely. That way you can make your snacks before you watch your anime. Whatever you watch. Probably anime. Only only a demon would have a house that would lay out like this and be watching anime at the same time. Now look at this layout. Look at it all awful. I'm sorry. It just upsets me. 
I mean, I don't care if you're a demon or something. I like money is money. But look, look at this. Look at this layout. What? Here, and then I get. I'll get your laptop done. Don't worry. You'll be. You'll be out there. You'll be out there trolling the internet in no time. Let me just stab these mentally bits to these mentally bits, and we'll be all good. Hey, I fixed your laptop. You know what? Okay. We just leave. Job's done. Hey, this is a dead end. That is equally a dead end eventually. Up. Uh, Hey, I'm just here to repair your aircon. Whoa, 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 whoa. Here, let me get it fixed. Do you not want me to fix your aircon? It's this one. You better not come in here and like start flying for the wall. You're paying me good money for this. It'd be a shame if, you know, something happened to me. With my hammer time. It's not broken cabinet. That is. Let's make sure you're far enough away. And let's lure you to the other side of the side of the house. To the kitchen. Maybe or this this other this other room you whoa whoa whoa. You're a little faster than I thought, yeah. I think it's just like, it's just coming after me. Like, I'm here doing a job and it's coming after me. It's like, you track mud on a carpet. That'll cost two hundred dollars to wash out. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Job complete. Thank you. Find ourselves some, uh, less dangerous jobs, that's for sure. Contractors aren't liked in this neighborhood. Hey. Is that it? Guess so. I guess that's it for Handy Worker's Tale. It actually, you actually blew up the game and doesn't let you play anymore. Like, this is it. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, that was, you know, a little short, kind of cute horror game, I guess you would call it. I don't think it needed a demon. I think it could have just had an overbearing customer who doesn't realize what they're doing. But I mean, that's what the demon was. It was just an overbearing, an overbearing demon that was like, just never satisfied with your work and just wanted a refund. So you're like, I need to get this job done, get out of here. Let the credit card companies handle it. Yeah, not much else to really say. It's it's very much a game that is what it is. Anyway, so thank you all for watching Play the Handy Worker's Tale. I'll see you guys later and take it easy.